Yeah. This is in my Spotify. Yeah. I listen to it. Well, I don't want to say, I'm not going to say when I listen to it. You're watching Hive Mind, the most momentous show on the internet. My name is Riley, and as always, I'm joined by creationist co-host Dignan. That's right. The world's only 20 years old. <laughs> <laughs> and once again, we are lucky enough to be joined by our friend, content creator, YouTuber, rapper, musician, and for your future car salesman, Quadeca. Yes! Today we're taking another taste of the sample platter. This is Guess, Guess the, the popular, popular Rap Song from the Sample. Here's how this one's gonna work. DJ Grant is gonna play us a song that is sampled in a popular rap song. We are gonna have to guess which popular rap song that is. One point for each one we get right. Me versus Dignan versus Quadeca versus you. Steph Jane from West Virginia. And before we get into it, make sure you like the video, subscribe if you wanna see more, go to HiveMindTV.com and check out our merch. We got a cartoon puns poster up over there. And join our Patreon, linked in the description. It's five dollars a month. Best way to support us. You get extra content and you get to play us against to play against us in the games, like Steph Jane from West Virginia. Thanks, Steph. I'm so excited. I get to be on Hive Mind. I'm like, I get to sit next to my favorite people. Well, I guess not directly next to them, but DJ Grant. Let's hear a sample. Oh man, they both know it off rip. It sounds recognizable to me, but my brain is unwired today, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Three, two, one. God breathed on this, Kanye? God breathed, Kanye. Happy by Pharrell and Kendrick Lamar. <laughs> this is God Breathed by Kanye West. <laughs> is Kendrick Lamar unhappy? Isn't he? <laughs> no. <laughs> spelled the name wrong, no points for you. I know God it's Breathed Kanye on this. Wrong. Yeah, I spelled Kanye wrong. <laughs> I spelled it C-O-N-Y-A-Y. -Y. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! yeah. Where's that sample from, Grant? It is a live performance from Bellhead. That was that guy, he was like Buckethead. Before Buckethead, he wore a big bell and he'd go on stage <laughs> and he'd start clinking it around. And that's another childhood insecurity of mine. My haircut used to be like big on the sides like that, straight on the, in the top, it looked bellhead. like a big old bell. That's right. Ah. Well, nobody called me that, but I did in the mirror every day. It's bellhead, Bellhead, stupid Bellhead, nobody likes you. So when you played soccer, you were the bell of the ball. <laughs> Leave a like and subscribe for that. Disney sing-alongs will probably get us a ton of followers. Finding Nemo, finding Nemo, where's that fish? Uh, where's that fish? Yeah, finding Nemo, he's lost in the ocean. Who's gonna find him? Me and Ellen DeGeneres. <laughs> I love that. That's like my favorite Disney song ever. Yeah, I love that one. <laughs> I don't think I know this one. I don't think I know it either. I have a guess. Oh, what rapper plays violin? <laughs> Three, two, one. Put Lose Yourself by Eminem. I put a Whoop D by the CJ Man. I put Family Ties by uh, Baby Keem. This is not, One Train with ASAP Rocky, Kendrick Lamar, Joey Badass, Yellow It absolutely yeah. is. Yeah. Oh, big Duh. The, the Posse track. The Posse the song, yeah. I'm gonna be honest, I don't even, I can't even think what that song sounds oh, like. Oh, it's a great song. You're about to hear it. Uh, uh, feeling like a vigilante or a missionary. Tell my ASAP killers get they ready. You have never heard it. It's You've never heard I'm that? I'm such a bad, I've never heard it. That's you're crazy. not bad, dude. Wow. I think you're a good guy regardless. Man, you know what I like to do? After a big meal, to lay back like this, unbutton the belt, Sunday night football. <laughs> <laughs> oh, geez. Mm, man, it's been a long work week. Yeah, about six more of these. DJ Grant, proceed. God, is it bad if I don't if I don't know the name of the song? I thought Kendrick was on Happy. So. Right. <laughs> Can you do your goofy little dance? Yes. Ooh. Yes. Three, two, one. I put Good Day by Nappy Roots. I did the same. I did like an old Mac Miller song off like kids. This is favorite song by Chance the Rapper featuring Childish Gambino. Mm. 
Oh my god. Let's hear it, Grant. All I was singing was, gonna have a good day. And no, I'm not gonna be tired today. today. Chance, assy rapper, soccer, hacky sacker, cocky, khaki, jacket, jacker. Wow. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> Hasn't aged that well. I, it it sounds something like something Mac Miller might have like. That's a re sampled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then rapped over the beat again. Like yeah. the one that you guys were talking about. You Completely, know? yeah. I uh, almost guessed an old Mac Miller song just yeah. for fun because it sounded like in that realm. Yeah, it was yeah, like yeah. Mac Miller, Wiz Khalifa, Chitty Bang. Chitty Those Bang. all came to that. <laughs> Lou Reed, like to play with own shit. Yep, and an avid heroin addict. Which one's worse? That's up for you to decide. I, I feel like I can hear a resemblance of a vocal, like an old school vocal, like I can hear the cadence kind of starting. That's what it sounds like in my head. It's like crackling <laughs> through, like like you're in between radio stations. Yeah. And you're like, oh, I know that song, and then it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. tonight's broadcast is people kill, take a walk on the That sounds like a oh. dementia album. Yeah, that's what my brain feels like. <laughs> yeah. It sounds like crazy. Who's the dementia album? I'm stuck between radio stations. <laughs> Three, two, one. Can I kick it by a tribe Can called I Quest? Kick it. I put Xanax damage by Future. <laughs> is that a good guess? Is it? <laughs> this is Can I Kick It by a tribe Hell called yeah. Quest. Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Oh, it's also a logic. So I was gonna as a troll, right? By logic, and, and because he did it on the same beat. Yeah. And like did the exact same hook and off of Supermarket, which would have just been funny for me to be like, that's where the sample is mm. from. That is funny. I thought that that Danny Brown song yeah. sampled the same thing, but it's not. Yeah. I like thought that the entire time. I just thought it manipulated the sample, but mm -hmm. it's like, something completely different. Yeah, here I have another good ch childhood story. You know, like you have like sex ed class. My <laughs> teacher and uh, was sort of like this very hippie kind of lady, and she like was in a kickball league. She used to play the song and be like, "This is my entrance music in my kickball league." It's wow. it's, can I kick it? And then uh, yes, you can. Yeah. So I was like, "That's fire." Can I kick it? Can I kick it? I know you guys might be disappointed because Graydon's such a fan of the old school. Yeah. Me, on the other hand, not so much. Maybe when I say that I'm not, I'm not myself. <laughs> That's more my way. Yeah. <laughs> DJ Grant. Oh. That was a great sample. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I keep getting texts. Sorry. Oh my god, my phone's blowing up. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's like, stop texting me, I'm filming. You know? You're so famous. Ah, uh, there goes another one, dude. My bad, guys. Alright, I'm gonna put it on Do Not Disturb. Ah, oh, shoot. And I, see, I, see you. I just put it on Do Not Disturb. It's still going. It's weird. Give me, give me, I'll fix it. I'll just it. turn the phone off. Okay, yeah. I'll fix it. Slower for some reason. You're whistling. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. Star shopping, Star Lil Peep. Shopping peep. Ah, I put Lucid Dreams. This is Star Shopping by Lil Peep. There we go. What a great song. And great song. I wanted to make a comment, but I didn't want to give it away. Uh -huh. That Lil Peep just like has some of the best samples that is ever. True. Like, yeah. like you go back and listen to what he was sampling, and it opens up a, an amazing world of like great music. And that's what got me into Peep originally is yeah. the stuff that he was sampling. I was already a fan of. Yeah, yeah. And at first, I was a little skeptical just because I grew up on emo music. When people were like, "He's the future of emo," I like wasn't all the way into it yet. And then I was like, "Wait a minute." Sampling Bright Eyes, Sampling Modest Mouse, Boards of Canada, the microphones. I was like, yeah. this is like bass. Like they're pulling from really interesting places to make these songs. And yeah. that's what got me on board. It's how it's exactly. supposed to be, baby. Yeah. That's part of the reason that I love this game so much. Is yeah. That you get to actually hear where stuff is yeah, coming. Trace, we're tracing roots, baby. Yep. That's true. Mm -hmm. And my roots could use a little work. Do you got a good salon? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to pick up a point now, Grant, so serve me up a <laughs> hot dish of something I know. <laughs> it's on Dude, the tip of my I've heard, I, this is in my Spotify. Yeah. I listen to it. Well, I don't want to say 
I'm not gonna say when I listen to it. Could sex? Be a, could be a Christmas song. Could be a sex Christmas song. I hear the fucking beat drop on this. This one is pissing me off so much, bro. I mean, I'm sure I know the song. That's the frustrating part about this game. Connecting these pieces, very far from being able to do it today. And that's all right. Some days you're on, some days you're off, but every day I'm hot as fuck. And that's cool. That's yeah, that is, yeah, that. that's cool. That's I why mean, a lot of people give you the benefit of the doubt. Benefit of the doubt. Uh -huh. Never heard that phrase before. Really? Uh -uh. Three, two, one. I put Skepta Shutdown. Oh, that's a good guess. I put a Danny Brown song. I put something called Got It within the in the chorus by Ab Soul or Flatbush Zombies. This is Drive Me Crazy by Vic Mensa and Kate Trinata. Oh, oh that's that is. is fire. That's what it is. That's fire. fire. Back before Vic <sighs> Mensa turned into a freaky punk rocker. <laughs> <laughs> Leather vest. <laughs> motorcycle Vic Mensa. Yeah. I'm here and I know they've been waiting for me. Since I was 15, now I'm yellow. 100 miles and run it. Uh. Man, Katra knows how to make drums. I've got an idea for a video game. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Cancel culture the video game. Oh. There's like different levels and you have to ascend in fame, but they give you little tests here and there and how to navigate them. And there are all these little like quests, story-based game, and just one bad decision and you have to start all over <laughs> as somebody else. <laughs> That's beautiful. Or you have the option of, if you do get canceled, trying to rebrand. Yes. You get to rebrand if you get to a certain checkpoint. What do they have? They have a tweet on the screen with like five slurs on it and you have to decide whether or not to click send. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. It's retroactive. You don't make the decisions in the past. Oh, it's just you have about to how to deal it. with Oh, that's yeah. good. Yeah, you just have to navigate it. Like, okay, what am I going to do next? Well, and you, you I was thinking of a reality show. I, I had a similar idea to this where it's like a reality show that follows a PR person and Ooh. like, you know, because there's a lot of PR people that represent a lot of people and whenever somebody gets canceled, they go, they do a vid video with them and they and they have to like write the correct apology yeah. and like the best PR person gets to the next round, like an American Idol thing that's and America cool. votes on the best apology. <laughs> And the yeah. PR people don't know who they're going to be defending at right. the next yeah. level. So they're like, all right, David Dobrik, who got through that. Next, Kevin Spacey. And they're like, no, no, no. <laughs> DJ Grant, can you full send us the next sampled song? Sorry, I have IBS. I get the runs. Uh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> nice. It's a little it's pitchy. Good for a little bit. Good little, for like two lines. Yeah, it's just a little pitchy. I would work on that. But other than that, I'll work on it. It's got good tone. It's got it's Shut good space. Fuck up. It's decent. Yeah. Are people actually into getting their mouth spit in? Yeah, I'm into that. Really? Yeah. Like a yes. <laughs> is it? You're not is in the bit. No, not a bit. Are Love you it. into that? I put my hands up. Or one hand. Really? Are Did you that, not? Not, not yeah, just absolutely anybody. Absolutely not. I mean, no, yeah, it has to be the right person. Of course. Of course. I understand that, that it's something you do with your partner and it's right. like an intimate thing. But to me, yeah, that like is if like, I was at a NASCAR Allo show or whatever and yeah. he was like, no. did it, I would just like do it. I'd just be there. Like, <laughs> And that is just a foreign, repulsive concept to me. And I don't mean to kink shame. I'm not trying to do that. Yeah, I right. just don't. I don't understand it one bit. You couldn't shame me out of it. I love it. Three women in their lives have spit in my mouth. <laughs> Upon request. Uh, it has to be. That doesn't come up naturally. Yeah, it wasn't like it wasn't like I was like, hey, spit in my mouth. It was like <laughs> in, in the heat of the moment. Heat of the moment. <laughs> she spit in my <laughs> mouth. Wow. Did you swallow it all like dramatic? Like you look in her eyes and like, Swallow. Yes, absolutely. And then she was oh like, my God, oh, that shit. Is, do you like spit in your mouth? Really? <laughs> I'm the <laughs> only one in this You're room. You're the only one in this room who doesn't like oh, this. Oh, man. Is <laughs> Three, two, one. Drake song. Yeah, I put Marvin's Room. It's got to be a Drake song. No, it's Exchange by Bryson Tiller and also Deja Vu by J. Cole. It is Exchange by Bryson Tiller, yes. And also Deja Vu by J. Cole. Is that a sample in both of them? It, it's the exact same beat, and there was a big controversy. The producer was like, he stole it. No, he didn't steal it. But it's the same beat for both of them. I like Bryson. He's got some good songs. I especially like his I don't care attitude when it comes to like his music career. Like, <laughs> he he doesn't. just doesn't care about the, pro the quality of it? No, he cares about the quality, but like he does. He's not like always chomping at the bits to release and he doesn't have like a big online presence. Like, yeah, he's, he's not kinda, playing celebrity. He's no. just playing, hey, I'm just a guy who likes making music and it went 
big and whatever. Riley's always playing celebrity. That's why he doesn't like that. I'm playing celebrity? Well, yeah, you just whistled eight times to pretend <laughs> to get a bunch of texts. Like, <laughs> you want people to know that you're famous. I'm not playing celebrity. I'm playing cancel culture the video game. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're all playing that game in 2021. Oh, well said. You're brother. telling me, buddy. <laughs> Preaching to the MF and fucking shit choir. Yeah. You know, on Sunday night, I get home, I unbuckle right. my belt. Say Lean it. back, <laughs> crack open a you know a little Miller Lite. Let a Sunday night football commence. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> this guy gets it. I can't wait to watch football with you, bros. Later. This what happened when I think about you. I get in my feelings, yeah. I start reminiscing, yeah. <laughs> for me, oh, for me. Hey, Your guys. fans aren't even gonna get this because they're all such little young people. DJ Grant. Let's go. Come on, next song. Cause you know, all day they couldn't say the shit they wanted to say. They had the fake orgasms and shit. We can tell niggas today, hey, I wanna come, motherfucker. Oh yeah. If you don't know, you might as well just give up, bro. Where is my mind? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> the Pixie said it. Right. It's gotta be a Drake song. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta be a Drake song. <laughs> Sounds like something you would say. It's just gotta be a Drake song, right? <laughs> I don't think I'm cut out for these sports anymore. You know who's awesome? Wayne Brady. Oh, yeah. What a talent. Sing. Dance. Dance. Joke. Funny. Yeah. Sing. Cute. Cute as well. Yeah. Good looking. Wears a shirt that yes. is like good fit for, for oh, Wayne. Yeah. Wayne. He's like, a good shirt. he's got a good fit shirt. He's uh -huh. funny and he's singing dance. We call that in the business, the threats. Or he's got all the threats. It's a quadruple threat. That's what they say when I come out with a lot of drip. Oh, yeah. you heard that new song, uh, uh, Syphilis by Quadruple? <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. I love it by Lil Pump and Kanye. I put back in blood. <laughs> I love it by Lil Pump. Yeah. It is I love it by Lil Pump and Kanye West. I'm a sick fuck. I like a quick fuck. Your boyfriend is a door to me loving. See, here's something that I always wanted to happen is to switch the samples from that and Ultra Light Beam. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So the beginning of Ultra Light Beam just starts with, I wanna come, motherfucker. <laughs> this is a god dream. I wanna come, motherfucker. <laughs> You're such a fucking hoe. I love it. Banger. Probably the greatest song Little Pump will ever release in his career. Is that safe to say? Gucci no. Gang is probably better than that song. Boss. <laughs> Did you get it? I think so. If it's not this one, I'm gonna be fucking Irish. I really hope that I got it. Yeah, me too. Because if I got this one wrong, I don't I'm know. I'm very confused. Yeah. Three, two, one. Toxic, Toxic by Britney Spears. Toxic by Britney Spears. Yes! Toxic by Britney Spears. Three way, everybody touch boards. <laughs> My first Britney. point is Britney Spears. Yeah. <laughs> Popular rap song, Toxic by Britney Spears. There's nothing wrong with giant nipples either. What? What did you say? There's nothing wrong with my big giant nipples either. With yours? They're fine. They're huge, but it's <laughs> some people like them like that. <laughs> Pretty much my whole chest is a nipple at this point. They're both so big they've merged together. There's no bridge <laughs> between them. It's a Venn diagram. Yes. <laughs> oh, exactly. shit. My nipples are a Venn diagram. As the years go by, they have more and more in common. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about toxic. Yeah. <laughs> me at the zoo was the first video ever on YouTube. Yes. No, that was me at the zoo. I know, it was you at the zoo. Yeah, it was so fun. You look really, like, cute there. Thanks. You should go back to that style. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting a bunch of texts. All I care about is money and the city that I'm from. So wait a minute. This gets sampled by something else. Uh-huh. Who's got the nuts to sample Drake? In the money. Oh, Think I... about it. <laughs> Three, two, one. I put Jaded by Drake. I put 10 Feet by Juice World. I put Girls Want Girls by Drake. This is DJ Khaled featuring Drake, Rick Ross, and Lil Wayne. I'm on one. Oh. oh. That was a tough one. Care about his money in the city that I'm from. I'ma sip until I feel it. I'ma smoke until it's done. I just compartmentalize all of that Drake. Right. That's just like one Drake. Like yeah. that might as well have yeah. been on the same album. Well, Drake <laughs> the, Drake the type of guy to interpolate himself. <laughs> the end of the day. What is like the time difference between those songs dropping? It looks like it's the same year. That's what I'm saying. Like I, that's such an old song yeah. that I literally think of that as again. The same just, song. Yeah it's, like, yeah, it's literally yeah. just the same era of Drake. <laughs>
Mellotron. It's a Mellotron. Is it? Yeah. What's a Mellotron? It's a thing. I think it's like a synth that that sounds a lot like a flute. Yeah. Like a lot of the old Beatles stuff, like that has the best chords, it has a Mellotron. Mm -hmm. Mm. It just like sounds just like that, like so warm and sick, but like a real instrument. Hey, I'd rather toss one off the backboard than be laying on my backboard. I'd rather bank a shot than get shot at the bank. Yep. Three, two, one. I put Chamber of Reflection by Mac DeMarco. Chamber of Reflection by Mac DeMarco. I put Dick in a Box by The Lonely Island. (laughs) This is Chamber of Reflection by Mac DeMarco. Another acceptable answer is How You Feel by Travis Scott and Quavo off Huncho Jack. Uh, Oh! I knew there was a rap song that used it too, Mm -hmm. but I just, I know this song. Such a classic melody. I thought Dick in a Box could have been right. I know, right? It's like, it's still, yeah. I put my dick in a box. Yeah. <laughs> and then I gave it, it as a gift. Let's hear a little Mac DeMarco. Me and all my alt boys wearing Converse were absolutely sobbing to that song. <laughs> absolutely. Oh, yeah. yeah, I got blood all over my flannel to that song <laughs> yeah. once. Nose blood? No, tears. <laughs> it's just crying blood. Oh, that's kind of badass. Yeah. At least I thought I was. I was on a bunch of acid and I looked in the mirror and I thought I was crying blood. Yeah. And then I looked down at my flannel that was covered in blood. And then there was like some guy. You know that trip's still happening, right? Huh? It's still happening. You're still there. Are you sure? <laughs> I felt the come down. I mean, I don't, I feel kind of normal for the most part. I guess I could still be tripping. But I've been like driving around and stuff. Is that bad? <laughs> Is it bad? You have you've, you've, you've never owned a car. What? <laughs> You're not the driving. Fuck. <laughs> we don't exist. What? You guys don't exist? No. Yeah. Oh my god, dude! This is what this is the biggest goof of all time. <laughs> yep. That's what Holy does do. crap! It ruins your life. I really didn't. It's so weird. It all feels real. Uh-huh. Yeah. It's not real. Is what you no. guys are saying? No. Neither is Christmas. What? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Got another text. Are the texts real? DJ Grant, drop that last track. I really don't know this one, dude. I, I feel like But I, I feel like it sounds so familiar. Mm-hmm. I'm tripping and I got for a dream, man. Um, and I'm a lost soul. You know what I mean, dim, man. Dim, dim. Walking the Jesus steps, I'm in the sand. Dim, dim. Dim. Lord, give me help. Dim, give me your dim, hand. Dim, dim. Hey, Lord, you saved me. Dum dum. God, you saved me. Dum dum. Jesus, get off my back. Dum dum. Look at me, dim, here I stand. Dim, dim, dim. Yeah, he died for all of our sins. Dum dum. All right, I'm changing my answer to Kanye. Yeah. Yeah. Three, two, one. I've got. I love college by Asher Roth. <laughs> I put Scary Monsters by Skrillex. I had something from J. Cole on the sideline story. This is Solo Dolo by Kid Cudi. Oh, oh that is it. Oh. I'm so sorry, everybody. Dude, the minute you know what time it is. Oh, oh no, he's gonna play the song. Play the song, then I'll do it. Then I'll do it. My bad. Listen good. I don't have nobody. But what? I didn't even okay. really know that song that well. Like it sounded very familiar. Yeah. But in, I haven't listened to it enough to the point where I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It sounded fire. All right, Quad, you take another victory. <sighs> you know what time it is. I'm sorry, I guys. Know. Yeah, I don't even want to do it at this point. No, yeah. 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 It's a custom, you know. Uh huh. Here it goes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one more. One more. <laughs> And here comes the spoon. Yeah, he's gonna do the whole digging thing, yeah. so. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you look all too comfortable digging a grave. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, Quedeca wins another one. Uh, let us know if you got some, some samples you wanna see in this game. Send them to Grant, his at will be in the description. Other than that, make sure you like the video, subscribe, all the stuff I said at the beginning. Also, uh, Quedeca's got new music coming out. Also, his channel's linked in the description, all that stuff. We wanna thank him for being here. We love playing games with him. I, I wanna thank you for allowing me on here because as I said, this is the best channel on YouTube, period. Not a bit. It just is. It's a fact. And so I am so grateful to, you know, be a part of it. Well, we appreciate that and you're welcome anytime. Other than that, Dignan, you want to leave these wonderful people with some advice to leave or live their lives by. Don't corner something that's meaner than you. All right, this has been Hi My TV. We love you. We appreciate you. And we'll see you in the next video. No. Oh, shoot. Sorry. <laughs>
Did you watch the Yeah Boy for me? No. Come on. No. I just found out about this last week. The Yeah Boy. Shut the fuck up. The longest Yeah Boy. <laughs> when was that from? Originally, like 2014 or I something? That was like last week. It was like literally all over Periscope. I could do a be- much better impression of Joe Biden. You want to see it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get it because he's sleepy, Joe. Oh, he sleeps. Is that uh, a thing? Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't pay attention to politics that much. I try yeah, to stay neutral. I don't know. Huh?